media hype uh, that seems to be a problem for a lot of people tiny is also singing about it in his new song our uh, well, new video as well and uh, we'll be taking a look at that even more later on but he joins me in the studio i'll let you can play Charlie, what's up Kuyaka. good to see you yeah everything always, okay always bless bless well bless. i'm going to start off by putting you on the spot okay i know that when it comes to your music of course you made Ga very popular uh, in the music industry but also there's something that you love to do with the language as well Oboabe. Yeah. Okay, you have a lot of idioms that you, you know, add to your music and all that. So today, I want you to give us one, a proverb, before we even start the, the conversation. Okay, let's do this again. Yes. Okay, what does that mean? Um, it means like, in a way, you don't put all eggs in one basket. Okay. I mean, yeah, um, you make sure... You put things in order. Okay. Yeah, because um, nobody knows the next minute, not mm. even tomorrow. Is this something you've lived by all your life? Yeah. Um, I, or you've I made mistakes yeah. along the way? Yeah. You have made mistakes. Yeah. What are some of the mistakes you've made in your career? Um, I made a mistake. I made a mistake when I was recording my first album. Okay. Yeah, my, I did my first album in three. Okay, and yes. that was a mistake? That was a mistake. Why? Because I wasn't original. Mm. Yes, originality sells, you know. So um, after I put I put them in a bin. How well did it do? Of course, I mean that was the first album. But then why did you also record in three? Because that was what was popular. Yeah, that was popular. And then and you know during Killer Face and Forward, I was I was blending three and English together, yeah. and, you know. Yes. And so. you had left Ga, yes, you know, in you the know, shadows. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I, I think that was a mistake. That when I you switched to Ga, what was the feedback at that time? Um. Were there mixed feelings or nah. immediately? My there first, was my first gun rap I mm. wrote was Mokola, was Mokola yeah. and it's, it's a bomb. So yeah, it, yeah. So obviously people loved it. People loved it and motivated me more. So what do you speak? More. If I ask you to speak to originality in music currently, a lot of people feel like I want to be like Tiny. I want to be like a sack. And so when they start their music career, they try to sound like these artists. What would you say to? Too. Yeah, people. A lot, I hear a lot of people. People try to sound like me, and afterwards they change and mm -hmm. they become themselves. Yeah. So I, I, I think it's okay. It's okay for you to look up to somebody, and then you know, for the person to motivate you in life to do what you can do best, and later on you come out to yourself. But how would you, you know? be able to tell that's okay? This is not me, and maybe this is where I should go because that's what people would ac accept me for. It's not easy, is it? It's not, it's not. It's yeah, not. looking for your original self and trying to find yourself in this music industry. Social media is telling you one thing, you know, your, your account is saying another thing. You're not sure how to balance your career. How do you do it? How do I do it? You see, myself, I don't, I don't look, I don't, I don't watch people. Mm. I do me. Yeah, that's, definitely. That's, that's one thing about mm. me. So, I don't really focus on social media, what people are saying and then... Um, what maybe somebody these days when I post a picture or something people comment that yo we miss the old you we mm. want you to do you know the Mokolaka style and stuff but the game has changed okay yes if today let me let me say if today a Bradford drops by Moka, I don't mm. think it will be a hit like before you think so yeah yeah because the game has changed the okay. group and everything has changed mm. so myself I don't look at what people are saying okay I, I just I just focus on the right thing and I hate it when you say the game has changed does it mean that you move with the flow isn't that a way of not being original? No, originality. When you are original, you are original. Yeah. Even how you change, you will still be original. Still be. Okay. Yes. And if if you will be left back. So know? if ten years down the line it changes again, it means that we all have to readjust to that new change. You see, um, I believe in versatility. Yeah. When you are not versatile, I mean, you can't match the game. Yeah. So yeah, when it changes, I mean, you, you go hard on it, and you, you know, you be yourself and you still, hit on it. and then you hit on it still. Yeah. Well, you performed at uh, two events this weekend. One was the Zero Bola concert. The other was Kim Promises mm -hmm. concert. Let's talk about Zero Bola because their focus is on, um, you know, trying to solve the sanitation crisis that we have in this country. Yeah. This whole week, we've been discussing it. There's been an issue of possibly banning single plastics, uh, single-use plastics. Yeah. Some people are asking that we ban them completely, so that when you're going to buy something, you carry your own bowl or cup or whatever. What do you make? of it first of all have we done enough as a country uh, to fight sanitation you see that that would be a, a bit difficult mm. but i think um it's positive because um it's when when we banned it it will it really help a lot 
Okay. With the choking you, of the gutters and all that. You so see. you think they should ban yeah. single-use plastics? Yeah, like yeah. The rubber bags and the yeah, takeaway packs. The takeaway packs because, um, you know, when I travel outside mm -hmm. and I, I buy something, it's, it's not in the pack. Mm. They normally put in the paper. Yeah. You see, and that one is more after you just put in your bin. But is the issue about what they put your products into or is more about the attitudes of Ghanaians? Because even if it's paper and a Ghanaian decides to drop it. They'll still drop it. Exactly. <laughs> That's the problem. Yeah, so it's about time that, you know, we tell the whole Ghana to um, stop that because um, it's not helping the country. Is it going to be easy? It's not going to be easy, but we'll force it on them. We'll force it. Yes, we'll okay. force it. Uh, force it meaning about lashable so uh, in case you drop something about drop a meant when i drop up uh, police yeah. people we get traffic but you yeah. know yes not about drop me in, in the country so if you, uh, drop you, anything, you drop anything anything i mean you pick it up straight up okay so they shouldn't lash you but they should insist, yes, that, they you, insist that you, you pick you, it up yeah, you pick it up okay anyway let's talk about your your new music i know you dropped uh blessing over, over, blessing. over blessing that was how many months just um, like a month, a month or two ago, ago. Yeah, two months ago okay so tell me about that one before we talk about yeah, this over new blessing one. talks about um it talks about how god has blessed me in my mm. life um day in day out and you know blessings keep, keep coming yeah and um i'm always happy i'm the happiest person in the whole world that's nice yes and uh, so um that song talks about how God has blessed me. I'm, I'm saying thank you to God. Mm. Yes, and I'm, I'm, I, I just want everybody to understand that there's somebody who is living and yeah. this is God and he's taking good care of us. And right after that, I mean, a month after you, you, you have this new video that we're going to be playing yeah. as well, which is called Kojo Bisia. Bisia. What does it talk about? Kojo Bisia talks about, um, talks about the streets, okay. the industry. Uh, the industry, the yeah, music the, industry. Yeah, the music okay. industry. Um, talks about how man must be ugly and fearful man must be mentally strong and all that when you say ugly and fearful are we talking physical oh all out all out yes. but you are not ugly and fearful, so. <laughs> but, but you see when, when, when we say man must be ugly and fearful it doesn't mean that's why right, we say physical, physical. <laughs> <laughs> okay okay yeah you but, see mentally okay and and the music industry what exactly did you talk about in this um i spoke about how things some things are not going well you know things that people deserve done doesn't go to them mm. you know the whom you know is too much in the industry I yeah mean, yes um sometimes sometimes when you focus on those stuff it, it makes you feel like you're not good but you're the best but you are yeah yes so okay. i just want the people the up and coming and everybody listen to me everybody listen to kojo bisia um she understand that yo you can do it okay you know yeah don't watch what people say don't watch what people say and also there's a part that says that self-control is strength that's the new yeah. one um from kwame ifu imbo te me kasta kuna amena kudame lumi rapa flavor killing them my dada bada dan da dem my knee bada dan da dem my fa fa lady everything be gaga seke son kwemo na me chomo lady gaga ali de my father hmm oh money kapa let me hear you see me who could do this yeah oh money kapa oh money kapa this is a jab of someone that's how my soldier songs are, you know. Really? Yes. You might think I'm, I'm talking to somebody, <laughs> but there's nobody, man. I hear you. But yeah, your yeah. daughters are in this music video as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. Well, are you initiating them into the music industry gradually? Um, is that no, what no, it is? No, no, not really. Okay. Not really. Okay. Not really. All right. Anyway, so this is a new one and it's available online. Yeah, it's available online all out. It's on iTunes, everywhere, you know. So just go on there. Kojo Bisia. That's what they call yeah. it. Okay, well, this is all time will allow us. Next time I'll ask you why you chose Kojo Bisia as the title. <laughs> um, if somebody helped you out with that. But anyway, thank you so much, Tiny, oh, for joining me.